and it is a beautiful Saturday today. I've only done that six times and still just got it right. It is a little cold out today. It will be raining a little bit off and on. But today's video, what do I have planned? We have a little story time. And this isn't just any story. This is about my school. And one kid in general that I don't know his name to. Or the name of. So, it was, um... It was a Wednesday um, at about 1.15 uh, was when our C lunch got dismissed, which was the last lunch of the day because we have A, B, and C lunch. So the bell rings for C lunch to be dismissed. Everybody's acting normal, blah, blah, blah. I go to the nurse for medication every day right after C lunch. And by the way, this is the first day back from the Christmas break. By the way, cri Merry Christmas, late Christmas, Happy New Year. Um, so first day back from the Christmas break. So I'm walking to go to the nurse because that's what I do. And I during C, C lunch, you hear a big pop, okay? And as I'm walking to the nurse, you hear a big pop. And it sounds like like just like somebody with like a ginormous firecracker, okay? Well, as I'm walking to the nurse, you see it looks like a grenade. And it's shooting out smoke out the top of it as it's laying there on the floor and kids are just walking through the smoke. So there's like eight kids in the, the clinic right at that time telling the nurse that the smoke bomb went off. And we're all hoping that, well, the, the, the fire alarm doesn't go off because that will be a pain in the butt. Evacuating over a thousand kids. We'll get to that later. Um, so the smoke bomb goes off, I get my medication. I just sit in there to see if the alarm, fire alarm will go off because if I did walk back to class, I'd be stuck in the middle of it. So I stayed in there. So I kind of chatted and the bell rang to that everybody should be in fifth period at the time, the normal time that I usually leave the clinic. So I'm like, okay, perfect. Well, as I go to reach for the door handle, there goes the fire alarm. So we do the normal procedure, close all the doors, lock the doors, grab walkie talkies and start to leave the building. And then here a couple seconds later, you hear on the radio that it was a smoke alarm, like smoke bomb that went off. And it's just literally everybody I'm pretty sure that had a walkie talkie at that time was saying that it was a smoke bomb. And the principal, you know, everybody has, the principal has a walkie. So he could hear everything. And then a couple seconds after that, he comes on the intercom saying, this is not a drill. Please evacuate the building. Over a smoke bomb. So, you know what everybody does. Everybody's a little panicked. and But everybody calmly leaves the building. Which was, um, in the end, he was congratulated us from how smoothly we exited the building. And quickly we did. And so, we're standing there out in the staff parking lot in front of the building. And about 10-15 minutes goes by. So, there's... A cop pulls in and runs inside. Just runs inside. I don't know what happened out of, from there because I'm not allowed back in the building from there. So we are all standing in the staff parking lot. Well, then out of nowhere, six fire trucks roll in from behind us. And, you know, all the stupid kids start pulling out their phone like they're going to record the whole bit. Like they're literally, I gotta, I gotta record this. I, what are you going to do? Post it on TikTok? Gain two followers? Congratulations. Congratulations. <sighs> so, normal thing happens. They go in. They get all their equipment. They walk in the building. They're talking to APs, principals, counselors. They're all right there talking. And then about 30 seconds later, like five more fire trucks roll in. And then you have the one cop still there, but blah, blah, blah. And they do their thing. And we're just all standing out there with our backpacks on our phone. Kids were calling their moms like something was actually happening to their school. As they, But most of the kids that were out there in that parking lot walked past the smoke bomb. <sighs> kids are dumb. Anyways, the fire department finds out and they go investigate. Looked safe. Um, so they said that it was clear for us to go back in the building. So everybody slowly works their way back into the building. 
and goes to class. Fire department leaves. Oh, in the end, there was a total of uh, 12 fire trucks and then the one cop that showed up, which I don't know what happened to him. Um, but we go back inside, roll in our classrooms. And the principal comes on the intercom. He's like, uh, that was, first of all, great job, guys, for evacuating the building quickly and calmly. Um, basically, blah, 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 blah. Well, by that point, we've already wasted most of our fifth period. So, what did we do? We play Taboo. Um, I'm the first one to go up, and I either don't face the board, and my teacher puts the word, and they have to make me guess the word without saying the words that are on the... So, which... Just Google the rules for Taboo, and you'll understand what I'm saying. Um, and we just continue Taboo. Um, oh, also, when, when the principal was on the intercom, he was saying that they were already looking at the camera, like cameras, trying to find out who did it, and that there would be a prize for anybody that confessed who did it. And immediately, I'm pretty sure, there were 30 kids in the principal office writing out this one kid from what I was told. Um, so they're all get, getting their prize. I don't know when they're getting their prize. They will be getting it probably here soon. Um, the, the There's rumors going around now um, since it's three three days after that, the the kid has been caught and has a 15 day suspension plus a jail time after that. I don't know if that's true, but that's what happened. Anyway, guys, I hope you enjoyed the quick, probably seven minute long video. Me talking about my amazing smoke bomb story. I really do hope that you enjoyed. Um, I will be making another video here about my Christmas and stuff that I got. Uh, maybe even a new airsoft uh, video coming out here soon with all my airsoft stuff that I got Christmas. Um, little hint, hint there for you guys. Anyways, I hope you enjoyed the video. I will see you all wonderful people on the next video like I always do. Hope you enjoyed. Peace out, guys. No, oh, no, stop recording. Okay.